to like comment and subscribe to your girl i do a lot of vlog fashion content just here for the girls a whole girl's girl in the flesh different take on our vlogging style as i was editing i just felt it was very choppy i just thought it would be best for us to narrate and stand back here plt they're currently scouting out ambassadors and influencers if you know me you know one thing about me i'm a rep plt like they've been sponsoring me for years i'm speaking that into existence the material quality if you guys can do me a huge favor and make sure to just tag them go on my social media created a new instagram just to post all my fashion content dumps lifestyle travel basically to start over and attract an audience that is for me happy with how it looks and just what i'm creating for myself and i can't wait to see this account grow i do have my little notebook here i like to keep notes especially when i'm trying to be organized in the beginning of the vlog i really wasn't talking too much and i hate when i do that thinking to myself like did you really think everybody was gonna read your mind make it make sense in some type of way. I definitely haven't seen you guys since my room look like how it was looking. I'm sitting on my new vanity. Room updates, Puerto Rico trip, Galentine's, and just catching up. We're gonna do a room tour. I will include all of the room updates thus far, but I do wanna give you guys an in-depth room tour. Just let me know if that's something you guys are interested in seeing. I've been very hesitant to apply makeup. My skin has been doing so good. Truly, she's been flourishing. If you guys aren't new here, you know my whole little experience with my skincare and stuff and my struggle with just finding a product that works for me. I feel like I've really came across that product and I'm just so excited. I've been embracing my skin and just where I'm at in my journey. But today, y'all, we be. I hope you guys like this vlog. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. I love you guys so much, and I will see you in my next vlog. Like I said, I have been very hesitant to apply makeup, so I'm gonna do some minimal makeup today. Nothing too crazy, I hope. I always say I'm not gonna do anything too crazy and end up walling i'm gonna color correct just because i do have a few dark spots here and there i don't always color correct so i'm not recommending this as a fave but i do use the rescue bomb color correcting apricot cream this is by the same brand mighty patch hero mighty patch get stuck babe y'all so i've been working on working on my accent i want to call it a french accent but I don't know what kind of accent I'll be doing for real. Um, it's really cute. It's my favorite. Do you guys still color correct? Because I haven't color corrected in so long. I really want to see what the vibes are. Usually I, well recently, recently as in the past like year or so, I apply my face makeup first and then right before I get to like my powder and stuff do my eyebrows but I think today I'm gonna do my eyebrows I did freeze them I fill in the little sparse areas that I have on my face to give it more of a full look but we want to keep it natural fresh and fluffy so we are all corrected period I'm super excited to be narrating today tell me how you like the vibes I hate just putting out content just because I feel like I need to post content. I want it to make sense and I want to be proud of my content. So why not narrate, kind of set a vibe, vibe out together, do our makeup and chit chat. Let's see, where are we? I'm gonna go ahead and do my eyebrows. I do use the Brow Wiz by Anastasia. I've been using Anastasia for mad long. Like as long as I've been doing my makeup, Anastasia has been my go-to brows. I'm just gonna fill these in really quick. I first started, I did use the pomade. I have now switched over to the Brow Wiz because it gives you more of a natural, more defined look. This week has been kind of crazy just because I've been trying to keep up with my content and stuff. I have been debating if I want to switch over to short form content. I don't know, I need to dedicate to one or the other. With that being said, I want us to get into our Puerto Rico experience. I had the best time, you guys. I was really just in the moment. Hold on. 
I definitely cannot talk in focus. It was my first time in Puerto Rico. I had just came back from Atlanta. I was just booked and busy. Sweetheart. Just what my life consists of. Clothes, clothes, more clothes. Hey y'all. Good morning team. Hey guys, welcome to another vlog and welcome or welcome back. It's your girl Dez. Welcome to another vlog y'all. <laughs> groceries. I will play early in the morning. Today I'm gonna just spend some time packing, finish editing little mini errands, and I'm gonna try to make it to the gym. This is the tracksuit jumpsuit. This is the Comfort Club collection. Airport fits definitely matter. Going to, when I come home, I always look a hot mess. I just came back from Atlanta, such a time. I'm going to Puerto Rico. This is me and Trey's like vacation pre V-Day. So excited. One thing about me, when I don't know what to wear, I'm gonna wear a matching set. I think I'm gonna return this. I had to order this package, next day shipping, because my original package that I ordered that had these two same items, I thought didn't come in time, but they were really in my mailbox. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna see which one fits best, because I did order different sizes. We'll try this on. We're flying Frontier. You guys, Frontier is like my least favorite airline. They want you to bring on like a little ass purse as your carry-on. Anything beyond that, you have to pay for. I have a lot of washing to do. Do you guys use washing powder or detergent? Usually I use detergent, washing powder. Today is February 1st, happy first of the month. I hope you guys set some new goals. Just show up for yourself this month. Just take it day by day. Me, when I tend to think of things as a full month, I don't feel like I'm as productive. How can I be most productive and get the most out of my day today? Zara and how cute is this dress? I don't know, it's just giving me like classy brudge. I'm at Einstein's guys. This is my third time for baking avocado and tomato. I've been traveling around the world. I sit on my balcony and wonder how you feel it. I got a career that takes my time away from women. I cannot convince you that I love you for a living. I be on your line, feelings flowing like a river. You be tasting back, you a kiki on a river. Message say deliver, but I know that y'all don't get it. Why you introduce us if you knew that you was with him? Made me shake his hand, we y'all been fucking for a minute. Walk me off the plank because you know that I'm a swimmer. Supposed to be a dog. Puerto Rico was a vibe, loved it down i would definitely visit again i'm not gonna spend too much time on it you guys seen it i had the best time ever i didn't know how many stray cats they had just living there like them cats girl them cats is hibernating or not hibernating they're uh mating so there's like a lot of cats a lot of animals all around it was the first time i ever went snorkeling i would like to describe myself as very adventurous so I didn't doubt that I would enjoy the experience. Once we actually got to the location, y'all, I was, I was, I was dragging my feet. I don't like anything like slimy, scary. I just can't risk my life right now. It was an amazing experience. Our group was so fun and funny. Beautiful blue water. A place to take a girl's trip, vacation, family trip, whatever your heart desires. Officially in my hosting era, me and my sister hosted Valentine's, I think the weekend prior to Valentine's Day. Just wanna thank my friends, first and foremost. Uh, girl, we're supposed to be doing our makeup. The foundation I'm gonna be using today is the Fenty Beauty, what is this called? Ease Drop. This is lightweight, very lightweight actually. No skin, skin foundation. By the way, you guys, I am filming for TikTok as well. So, hey, TikTok. You guys, can we talk about how difficult it is to make friends as an adult? Like, growing up, I've never had a problem making friends. And I never thought I would have an issue just connecting with people. I'm just so grateful for my friends. Prime reason I shy away from hosting. Simply just a fear that no one will show up to an event that i'm hosting by the way i'm spurring with my 
Fix Plus. I usually use my Fix Plus to wet my product and apply my foundation. I always get super nervous that no one will show up to events that I host. But Galentine's was such a vibe. I am now so excited to host in the future. I've actually found like a new passion of mine. I really like hosting others and decorating and just setting a vibe for whatever occasion. And we bought a whole lot, a whole lot of maybe a little too much. Actually, we need it. We needed it all. I definitely prefer to have than to not have. So um, let's just recap Galentine's weekend. Don't be trying to check our chicken nuggets. Y'all, quick grocery haul. We got some dumplings from Trader Joe's. Got these from Costco. Super good. If you guys ever tried Chili's Southwestern Rolls, tastes just like it. Uh, pizza, this is California crust. I wish it was thin, because I'm definitely a thin crust type of girl. These little chocolate pandas for a snack. For all the protein girls, this has 15 grams of protein. So now I got some protein drinks, some fruit. This is actually going downstairs with the rest of our Galentine's for these. We found these hot links in Costco, some goldfish. Oh, I wanted to take a few of these though. Y'all look at this weather. Crazy. Which one looks the best? The ones that have the, um, you know, this perspirated when there's like water droplets on it, those have been out longer. Okay, so we'll do these ones. $12? That's, That's it? Okay. Girl, and all this time I've been spending all this money. No, no. We don't do brown. The bad bitches do tequila. Go first. It's a big ass bottle too. Is that crazy to get this? Not really, we'll just always have liquor. Oh, it's $80. Girl, I said it's $38. I thought it was too, I was trying to figure it out. That smells nice. Two, three, four. We're missing one. Cool, we're good. Perfect. Timmy Osh. How long have you done like YouTube? Three, four, five. Um, Thank you so much. What if I accidentally let these go and they just flew out is up in the air? I would have to say, hey ma'am, you're gonna have to fill these back up. Hey guys, game prep for Valentine's. Valentine, Galentine per. How cute, we found these in Costco. We're gonna start making our charcuterie board. I hope I'm not copyrighted, y'all. Let's turn it off. Okay. Okay. Made it back home, finally. The amount of stuff we purchased is crazy. A few balloons to hang in the bar. I'll be in the shower, I can't wait for you guys to see. Well, I'm just putting cotton candy on top of them. Matching outfits for Galentine's was tea. Let's talk about it. Victoria definitely came through. Everything with Galentine's was so last minute. We we're debating if we were actually gonna do it. It was gonna work for everybody. The timing was a little off. 
it really all just came together i just really appreciate my friends just for showing up we were missing two technically not in attendance honey I'm sure you guys seen arshia on my channel before she was over like three hours away started snowing like we live in cold ass colorado so many more events to come we're gonna let that dry because i oversprayed but i can't wait to continue to host more girls nights i hope you guys had a great valentine's my valentine's was amazing i actually was super busy just with work and stuff for me personally my love language isn't gifts or anything like that it's really acts of service just like showing appreciation and that is exactly what he did and i'm just so grateful i hope you guys had an amazing valentine's day whether you spent that with friends family i love that i love that for all of us I've just been feeling so inspired. A lot of that comes from my space. I'm just so grateful. When I sit back and just think of how good God is and just how blessed I am, I'm in awe. The way God has turned that around for me I can do nothing but do everything I said I would do. I have been loving my vanity so much like my space just the illumination it brings to my room the intimate time with myself the girls know like getting ready is a whole state of mind and just being able to share that point of view or that time with you guys i'm just very appreciative we don't want to hear you go on and on i actually had attempted to put my own vanity together first of all this vanity literally weighed over 200 pounds it came with a thousand pieces i attempted to put it together but i was unable to put it together myself if you guys don't know task rabbit is a website or an app that you can use to find handyman anything that you are unable to do maintenance or handiwork without that this vanity would not be standing i pulled out this bag that i had hidden in the corner i completely forgot i got this skirt it's like a cargo sweat skirt you get the vibes but stop they're so cute these are my current faves speaking of this dresser this has to go like this has been up here too long i'm straightening up my room yep 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 mm -hmm. all these clothes are clean i just been piling from traveling definitely cannot function like this brb Oh my gosh, you guys, there's no way I could have did this by myself. Child, let me catch my breath. I don't know why I want to call him a constructor, but the person who helped that I hired from Tax Rabbit, he just finished my vanity. Obsessed. Got this off of Amazon. It'll be in my Amazon storefront. T. Currently headed to the mall. You guys, I am actually going to go pick up a raffle. I used to be like a major sneakerhead back when. Still am. These fours that are coming out, they are leather, black and red. I was thinking they would be super cute just to add a little texture to outfits because I don't really have a lot of leather shoes. I also have an extra pajama set that I bought for Galentine's that I no longer need. What's going on, babes? Oh, and I bought some new lights, you guys. I'm also really excited for that to come. So when I'm making my content and stuff, just when I feel like I need additional white lights, I'm like definitely a sun natural lighting girl. I really, especially when I'm creating content, my camera's about to die. I didn't bring another, I didn't bring another charger. That's crazy. We got you chasing waterfalls, why you holding on? You don't know, I know sure Let me try these on. Yeah, you're all good. I'm done. I'm just kind of tired with the sound roof. To 
show my appreciation to myself i just really try to keep my space very organized setting up my vanity has been so exciting for me creating our creative space I seen when I went to American Furniture, I seen this white, I seen this white chair. Skims, super cute. Purple is my favorite color and lavender is my favorite shade of purple. Once again, we have another package. If you guys watch, my girl Talitha, she actually recommended these lights. She makes a lot of content, a lot of wonderful, good content. So make sure to follow me on my new Instagram. I've been pre-filming a lot of short form content. It's given not afraid to be seen. Why am I like this? This is so dramatic. Girl! Comes with two plates a tripod i don't know what this is so you know what i actually don't have time to do all of this right now and i don't need the extra lighting at the moment so we'll unbox that later my shopping habits have been crazy i just recently slow down i have to buy everything at one time i realized that i was getting package after package day after day so happy that is over definitely well spent just prepping to bringing it all together recently i've slowed down on vlogging everything i get in the mail just because it can get a little repetitive but i know i was shopping literally till i dropped wait but can we talk about the packaging like how adorbs i'm manifesting to be a brand ambassador for lorve i'm gonna speak this now what's today's date because i'm big on timestamp. today is february 18th 4 52 the packaging is so cute i have one other pair of lorve glasses passion and just like what she is good at she's mastered that um You joking? It's wrong because I can't. I woo. Yeah. So what was that? Oh no! Class and session, babes. These are so cute. No, I'm going on the website. Like, if you guys thought I was playing, I'm literally going on the website right now. Ordered these cups. Super cute. Amazon. I'll make sure to link them down below. This is just for my iced coffee. Um, I want to start vlogging on TikTok. Realistic. When I say realistic, I mean like actual sounds. Just how girly and dainty. I have clothes. I have to fold. You guys know how I feel about clothes. Un unattended. Put all this stuff away. So I'm going to order these cards off of Amazon. They're kind of, I forgot what the game is called. They're called Tell Me More. They're pretty much like a conversation starter. These are cards that I'm going to pull and just talk about the topics. While I'm doing my get ready with me, we're just chatting. We could be here. I just am always curious like what someone else thinks about a topic um, compared to like how I think about a topic. So I think those will be really good, really cool to just incorporate in the vlogs just so we can get to know each other. But once I get to talking, I like am a chatterbox. For me, it takes me a little time to get going. And then I'm like in this space where I, I could just talk freely. I really love that for me. I am trying to just open up how I think, just how I um, present myself and perceive information. My grandma said, girl, shut up. up. I am about to kind of plan out my week and see what is non-negotiable things I need to do. That has definitely been working for me, making non-negotiables in... Um, Completing it really comes down to what you find important. What you find important, you're gonna make time for. Let a babe. 
By the way, you guys, I'm using Fenty Beauty Powder. This is in the shade Honey. This has quite literally lasted me over five to six years. I'm officially almost out. I just use this to set my concealer in lightly before I bronze. Good morning. I'm getting ready to film my hygiene shopping video. That will be a whole separate video from this vlog. I just wanted to say good morning to you guys. Transform from clean girl to bad bitch. I really do need a lot of um. I don't need like a lot, but I do need some re-ups and stuff. Third, all my storage out. I'm also working on this vlog you guys are watching right now. I'm sure my hygiene video is gonna be out way before this video. Recently, I've been getting the lemon, lemon kale ginger smoothie. Really good if you like tart ginger. If you like ginger, girl. If you like lemon, that's exactly what it's giving. I hope you guys are enjoying the vlog. To be honest, I really started editing it yesterday, so I have no idea what this vlog really entails you here i'm here and we here together i am currently watching hygiene videos i like to get you know a little inspo from the girls everyone's just so creative on youtube that's why i love youtube the girls just be bossing i love to see that i'm gonna finish my makeup and i'll come back to you guys i don't know maybe before i leave or after i film my hygiene video <laughs> Hey y'all, we didn't do too bad. I came out spending a little over a hundred dollars. So I have secured my Girl Scout cookies. Just out of curiosity, what kind of Girl Scout cookies do you guys get? Um, usually Thin Mints are my go-to. Trey likes the Samoas. Mm, I just have to be in the mood for them and these are like, you know, you know, but you guys let me know I'm very curious. What is your faves and do you guys get the Boy Scout popcorn? Or are we just sticking with the Girl Scout vibes back home? Just wrapped up my hygiene video. I am so proud of myself I'm really just doing what I said I was gonna do the only thing that I didn't get to really complete is um, taking pictures Ugh, And I didn't get I didn't get a reel. I didn't make any reel today I'm trying to keep up with TikTok, but if I'm being honest, you guys, it's kind of, I don't want to say difficult, but it takes a lot of strategy to keep up with all these platforms. Like, my advice is really to choose two major platforms that you want to, you know, do your do with and go from there. Um, I kind of want to film my little haul again. I like filming me chilling. That's why I really like vlogging because I don't have to think too hard about just how something looks and i really do like that whole aesthetic we were supposed to go to the store today me and the girls when i'm referring to the girls i mean those that are in our household we have set a plan for ourselves we've been doing really good with prepping and all the things today's wednesday and wednesday is actually one of the days that we chose to re-up on our grocery shopping it's almost 6 30 probably going to house number two tonight i have to make it to the store today because i was filming and doing content and stuff like that so i wanted to update you guys i finished my video i'm so proud of myself so happy i'm about to take off my makeup and get ready for tomorrow here's all the stuff that i got from target so i'm gonna complete my thumbnails and honestly i'm gonna spend all tomorrow editing that video we need a post at least you guys got to see me y'all instagram <laughs> Don't go looking for me on Instagram because I've been going through so many outfits, so many looks, and I'm so hurt a lot of the times that I'm not able to get that content or document it there. But at least I'm able to document it with you guys. And it just really sucked to look so damn good but not be able to document it. That's what's happening. Packages, packages, more packages. What are you galloping around here about? Like... So we have two new pickups. Let's talk. I have to return the truck. I rented a rental car to bring this stuff home. BRB. 
Hey guys! Long time with no see, not really. It's been like seconds for you guys, but I haven't talked to you guys all day. Sorry y'all, y'all know I got issues with my breathing. Whew. So, you guys, quick update. I had my handyman come a few days ago. I think I got it put up on Thursday. Today is Saturday. I really do like it. So, you guys, I was at American Furniture today. Here we go. Okay, bookie, period. So you guys, I was at American Furniture today. I went to go pick up my chair. I'm not sure if I really ever gave you guys details on this new vanity chair that I really liked. It's beige. The chair that I was using before, it didn't have handles. It's not tall enough. I came across this rug right here. As you guys can see, the material is very soft and luxury the real tea is decision maker i'm gonna put this on my floor my thing is i wanted my room to give very girly cozy but i don't want it to get childish i don't know i want to bring a very grown and sexy element back into my room um i really think that comes from my bedding i'm gonna go darker with my bedding i'm not gonna do white on white on white no matter what color i change my um bedding too it'll always flow i really need to change the skirt on my bed so it all makes sense but i'm not i'm not gonna mess with that right now okay of course you just sit there you just nosy i know i didn't need like a super big or long rug okay I'll be back, you guys. I have to vacuum. Okay. So this is what we're looking like. I'm not mad at it. Only thing I would change is, honestly, if I could, I would probably get it a little bigger to fill up this space. What do you guys think? Is, does it look awkward or does it make sense? By the way, I took that box spring stuff off. I'll go buy a new spring. The rug feels really good though. It's like gliding. I like it, I really do. Maybe I could get a bigger one to fill in this space. <laughs> perfect length. I'll unwrap this really quick and then we'll see what it looks like. Ah, she's beautiful. Listen, do not come to play. Hey, you guys, I love this goes perfect with my whole room decor. Um, as you can see, it's this, I never know what to call this texture, but what is this texture, you guys? And this chair comes with a swivel so you can turn as needed. I'll make sure to link this down below. I got this from American Furniture. You retail for two twenty-eight. dollars Excuse me, businesswoman. I'm gagged. When I found out that Target had glass straws, they called their own Talking glass to my hygiene straw, which haul, I love, but I wanted some like individual clothes. I could have some glass straws. I had to get my glass straws. And I'm going in with my Mocha Mommy bronze this is a nice like bronzy plum red kind of brown great for all the brown skin and i just honestly dab have any technique i'm just bringing a little color back to my face i'm applying it to my high temples my cheekbones and my nose so we have come to and ends and i'm kind of sad i really loved narrating and talking to you guys i hope i have updated you guys and i was very clear with just what was going on in the blog i know i'm not always going to narrate i don't plan to just not explain after i edited i realized i obviously was doing a lot of talking but i just wanted it to make sense and just all flow together. Let me know what you guys think. We are on our last final and fave step. I'm gonna go ahead and apply my lip liner. This is my all time favorite MAC Chestnut. Literally you guys, this is my favorite step. Like one thing I don't play about is my lip gloss and lip liner. 
That is something that is essential in my purse. Before we do that, just in case I didn't include in the vlog or if I did, I don't know. Um, I did want to do a little card with you guys. This game is called Tell Me More and it's basically just to deepen your connection with whoever you're playing with, get to know me type of questions. I told you guys, I'm gonna start pulling these cards when we do get ready with me, just so we can have a topic. And I would love for you guys to comment down below and let me know your take on the question so we can chat and just chop it up. If we go over this, this always gives me like the perfect brats look. If you were to ask me, would you ever get any work done on your body or anything? Honestly, I'm very happy with my body, um, but one thing I would get done is my lips. I would definitely get lip filler. Like, I love the plump, not too big, but like, I like big lips. I would get my lips done. <laughs> I would, y'all, I'm just being honest. I would get my lips done because I just love that vibe. I love a good poker, ratty lip but besides that let's see what our card says the first card what's a habit or routine you like to get into so on brand a good habit or routine i would like to get into really just consistency like that is a habit i have been practicing just to make a part of just who i am whether that be youtube working out just things in my daily life i just want to be consistent with everything i do i want to be known for being reliable so that's definitely a habit i've been working on because it really comes down to like your dedication like for me i strongly believe if you want something if you want it bad enough, you'll make it happen. How that looks for me is just dedication and focus. I get distracted. Um, sometimes I get bored and that causes me to distract myself. Staying on course with just where I know I need to be spending my time, what I need to be doing in that moment. I definitely like to continue to be consistent and be present and relevant if you don't take yourself serious nobody's gonna take you serious um i would love to hear what habits you guys would like to continue to incorporate or start practicing we're still in early parts of the year we're in march if you set some goals and you kind of fell off get back to it it's okay we all fall off sometimes just get back to it don't give up and just stay at it until you reap your results that is it for our narration i hope you guys enjoyed narrating des love you so much t2yl